Reuters, Broadcom Ltd, ABGOO, on Tuesday cut the number of board seats it was trying to win at Qualcomm Inc, QCOMO, to 6 from 11, and reiterated that its offer for the company was only good until the conclusion of a March 6 shareholder meeting at the chipmaker. Broadcoma Euro trademark S move comes a day ahead of planned talks between the semiconductor companies to discuss the potential $121 billion deal, which will be their first such discussion, people familiar with the matter told Reuters on Sunday. Broadcom said it would withdraw its offer if it was not accepted by Qualcomm a Euro trademark S executives or unless its six nominees were elected at the shareholder meeting. Qualcomm could not be immediately reached for comment. Broadcom raised its cash and stock offer last week to $82 per share from $70, and made other concessions, including offering to pay Qualcomm an $8 billion breakup fee should antitrust regulators block the deal. Qualcomm rejected the revised offer, as it did the first bid, saying the proposal undervalued the company and fell well short of commitments on regulatory issues. Broadcom had nominated a slate of 11 directors to replace Qualcomm a Euro trademark S board, after it rejected the first bid, worth $103 billion. Broadcom a Euro trademark S6 nominees are Sammy Elledge, David Golden, Veronica Hagen, Julie Hill, John Kispert, and Harry Yu. Moelis and CEO, Citi, Deutsche Bank, JP Morgan, Boffe Merrill Lynch, Morgan Stanley, and Wells Fargo Securities were Broadcom Euro Trademark S financial advisors. Qualcomm Euro Trademark S shares were up marginally pre market at $65.69, while Broadcom Euro Trademark S stock dipped 0.5% to $243.18.